What is it like being a Muslim in Korea? Are your Korean friends are understanding about your religion and respect about it? If you asked me this question like three years ago, it would be very difficult. A lot of Koreans might stare at us. Hello friends, welcome to my channel. I'm Jin. Today I'm here at mosque in Itaewon, which is the first mosque built in 1976. Today I interviewed some Muslim who are living in Korea and asked them what is it like being a Muslim in Korea. Let's get into it. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. How are you? Uh, I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Could you introduce yourself? Uh, my name is Anod. I'm from Oman, next to Saudi Arabia. Yeah. I'm studying here marketing, master's in mm. Busan National University. I am living in Korea for four years and a half. Are you living in Seoul at the moment? Yeah, at the moment I'm living in Seoul, but I was in Busan, but I graduated this semester. Ah, you graduated? Yes. Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> this is Shajat. I am from Bangladesh. Mm -hmm. I stay in Korea around seven years. Seven years? Yes, I do wow. my bachelor's, master's, and now I am doing my PhD. Um, hello, my name is Atia, and I'm from Malaysia. And I'm currently in my senior year mm -hmm. in Korea University. I'm taking biotechnology course. Mm. How long have you been in Korea? Almost four years. Four years? Yeah. <laughs> Today's topic is, what is it like being a Muslim in Korea? If you asked me this question like three years ago, it would be very difficult. Oh, really? But nowadays, like Korea is more of Muslim friendly. So people are very nice to Muslims. Mm -hmm. And even the restaurants and even like everywhere you go, it's very Muslim friendly. I think it's okay. Uh, like uh, Korean people don't care about other people's religion. Mm -hmm. They respect. Like so most of my Korean friends, my colleagues, they think, oh, you are Muslim. They think we are feel difficulties in Korea. Mm -hmm. But I tell them it's okay. I think it's okay in Korea compared to other countries. Mm -hmm. What countries have you been before Korea? I've been to Japan mm -hmm. and I think that Japan is less welcoming for Muslims in mm -hmm. terms of our accommodations, like that, that kind of stuff. When it comes to food, yeah. I know that Korean food has a lot of pork inside. Yeah. Is it hard to find a halal food on the restaurant or grocery stores? Like, what do you think? Yeah, there are a lot of Muslim-friendly restaurants mm. in Korea, especially around Itaewon mm -hmm. and maybe in Myeongdong. In Seoul, it's not difficult. Mm -hmm. But if you go another like area in Korea, mm -hmm. it will be very difficult. Mm -hmm. But in Seoul, you have like vegan food, like mm -hmm. the Korean food, but it's in a vegan way. Oh. So it's very easy to eat like this kind of food. Mm -hmm. And you have a lot of halal food like here in Etuan and like in other places. Sometimes we are uh, try to find the good halal restaurants. Yeah. Like in popular area, it's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They have lots of halal restaurants, but yeah. in rural area they mm -hmm. don't have. Uh, like we can't find any halal meats. Most of the tourists yeah. came to South Korea, they think just only pork is not halal, it's haram. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. in Korea, most of meats, like chicken also, we Muslim people can't eat. Because, really? yes, because when we cut the chicken, we should cut by the name of Allah. Mm -hmm. If the chicken or the beef or the animals, not cutting by the name of Allah, mm -hmm. Muslim people can't eat. Ah. So that's why we feel difficulties to ah. find a halal food. You mean the way how they, um, they kill the animal? Kill the animal. They have to cut by the name of Allah. Ah. So you can only eat in halal restaurant. Halal restaurant, yeah. Ah. That's really interesting. Or we can buy from online. Then mm -hmm. we need to cook. Ah. There have some online halal food store. Ah. Uh -huh. And the next question is, is there any difficulties or discrimination that you had as a Muslim in Korea? Mm, I think not. Maybe a lot of Koreans might stare at us because like, mm. especially if we wear hijab. Yeah, yeah. And I think they are most likely curious about it, especially older people. And currently I'm doing an internship in Korean government and they are really understanding of my needs. Like I have some time that I have to pray and they let me use a room and they don't disturb me during my prayers. So I think they are really great. Oh. 
That's really nice, I think. I don't feel any discrimination. Oh, like nice. when uh, people ask me about my religion, when I say I am a Muslim, mm -hmm. they say, oh, nice. Mm -hmm. They just think it's okay. Uh, most of Korean people don't have any religion, yeah, sure. but they respect mm -hmm. other religion. Like in our class time, if I ask my professor, mm -hmm. professor, I need to pray. Oh, he said, oh, it's okay. No problem. You can pray. Mm -hmm. First, it depends on the person, like mm -hmm. how you see the situations, because a lot of people uh, in Korea, the, like they are very curious about uh, yeah, yeah. hijab mm -hmm. and isn't it hot to wear this like during mm -hmm. summer? Mm -hmm. Actually, it's hot, but because <laughs> we get used to it. Yeah. And some of Korean people also really want to know about Islam. Oh. They ask me many times, so why you don't eat pork? Why yeah. you don't drink? Oh. Why you don't go to the club? Oh. Yeah, they are. They're curious. Yeah, they are they curious want to, about. Want to know, learn. Yeah, want to learn about Muslim. Mm. But in Seoul, I didn't face this kind of situations. But mm. in Busan, it was a little bit different because mm. there are not a lot of hijabis and like Muslims, like yeah. the girls especially. Yeah. So a lot of people who are Christian, like they find it very different yeah. when they see us. Yeah. And could you tell me about the story in your uh, on the <laughs> subway? <laughs> so once I was in the vitro in Busan and one of the Christian who was like uh, believe in Jesus and everything I was like yeah. okay I didn't talk but like someone who was next to me mm -hmm. he was like like leave her alone and go your way stuff mm -hmm. like that mm -hmm. so actually there are a lot of Koreans who are understandable like yeah. for us but there are like most of them are old people so yeah, yeah, yeah. we can understand them mm -hmm. yeah you can easily encounter people on the street like yeah, trying yeah. to make them believe yeah, exactly, like something. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. So we, we have this kind of stuff in our country, so we can understand it. Oh, okay. Yeah. okay. The next question is, are your Korean friends are understanding about your religion and the respect about it? Yes, uh, when they know about my religion, they said, oh, it's okay. Mm. Uh, we respect also uh, other religion, so no problem. You follow your religion. Some of Korean people also have religion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They said, okay, my religion is mine. Your religion you can mm. follow. So I have two types of friends. Yeah. The first one who have a background about Arabs and Muslims. Mm -hmm. So they, of course, they will understand. Mm -hmm. And I have the second type of Korean friends who yeah. are, they don't know anything about Muslims. Mm -hmm. But they actually, they understand. Like when I tell them, like, I can't eat anything with pork and everything. Mm -hmm. They search for restaurants that is okay to go to. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. places where they don't have, like, alcohol and stuff like that. Yeah. And oh. they are very nice. Mm -hmm. Like... Even when they walk with me, like you know how people we attract a lot of internship because of our outfits. Yeah. But they don't feel like embarrassed or anything. Oh. It's very nice of them. Yeah, my Korean friends, most of them, they are really understanding. Mm. Especially when like we have to eat certain food, like halal food. Mm. And if we go out, then they will find restaurants that we can eat. Is it hard to find a place to pray? I heard there are not many uh, mosques or musala in Korea, so what do you think? When it comes to prayer room, it's harder than finding restaurants. Mm. But that's why we almost like just pray anywhere there's mm. no one. Mm. In Seoul, you have a lot of places because, like, you know, they attract a lot of tourists. Mm -hmm. But outside Seoul, it's very difficult because, mm -hmm. like, in Korea, there is only there are only three mosques. Mm -hmm. But for the Musalle, you can find it in the airports, in the hotels, mm -hmm. in some of the restaurants. Uh, it's difficult to find mosque, like Musalla. Yeah, yeah. Like, some of popular area have some mosque, but in rural area, don't have any. But university, they give us like prayer room, mm. like one room you can pray. Like mm. in my university, we have a prayer room. Mm. So it's easy, it's no problem oh. at all. So I think if uh, government gives some opportunities, like make some masjid or masalla in some rural area also, it mm. will be better for Muslim people. Mm -hmm. Then the last question is, do you have anything you want to say to Muslim people who want to come to Korea? Everyone is welcome to South Korea. It's a better place to travel, to enjoy your life. You can learn many culture and many entertainment things in South Korea. And it's all places are safe, no problem at all. I think if you are a Muslim, then you don't have to worry about coming to Korea because they are really Muslim friendly. 
Well, Korea is a very interesting country. Yeah. And the people are very nice. You should come and your mind is open. Oh. <laughs> like, don't be like closed. And like, people are very curious in here. Yeah. So you may find a lot, face a lot of questions, but mm -hmm. it's okay. Like, you just need to explain it to them. Mm. Like, there are a lot of places. The food is so good. Kimchi is so good. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> yeah. You like kimchi? Yeah. <laughs> If they have the chance to visit Korea, I actually encourage them to do that because mm -hmm. it's like an experience you can't like you don't want to miss it like wow. in your life. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> okay, thank you so much for thank the interview. You. Thank you for giving chance to tell something about Islam mm -hmm. and have a good day. You too. Thank you. Bye -bye. Thank you. Have a nice day. <laughs> you too. Okay, thank you.